What a spot to spend your Saturday afternoon. We are on the island of Bermuda for the third round of the Butterfield Bermuda Championship at Port Royal Golf Course. Par 5 seventh, Ben Griffin tied for the lead at 16 under. How good is this? Thank you. To kick in range, Ben Griffin with the birdie. It was in the completely opposite direction yesterday as well. Little low checker. Oh, wow. Nice. Yeah, that's well done. 48th in the official world golf ranking. That's Seamus Power at the ninth. Wind out of the right. And a much easier hole than yesterday. It was back into the wind, as Karen said, just a dead opposite wind. And that is well done for Seamus. You really have to pay close attention to your shot shape, your trajectories, and your club selection, too. Uh, there we go. Nice. That's yeah. what he's been doing all week. He has putts. absolutely been putting quite well, and well, he's a five time winner on the PGA Tour. Yes, he does. Kevin, you. Oh. So you can get this ball really close to the hole on 443 downhill. Rough, really not an issue. Today's hole location all the way in the back left. And Seamus Power doing exactly what you would expect on a downwind wedge shot. And now Seamus Power, the only issue here is, is the wind. No break in here, just confident stroke. Good stroke at 10, good stroke at 11, and we have a new leader. All right, Smiley, let's see if we can get Smotherman going here at the 11th. Yeah, I feel like he's due. It's been a while since he's made one. Well, there we go. There we go. Now we're going. Because right isn't the best lead today. Very below the green and not where you want to hit it. Yeah, this is going to be good using that backstop. Great shot right there. And here we are at the 11th, Ben Crane. This has kind of been in his range this week. Uh, he's made a number of putts from this length and uh, add that one to the list. Uh, yeah, reason to smile. It's definitely yeah. not his routine. It's, it's, uh, it's it is just so exposed on top of this hill. Yeah, and the greens are only 10 and a half on the step meter because of days like this right here in Bermuda. They keep the greens a little slower. Yeah, it did. 50 yard run. We don't need that trip. No. If Seamus is in contention and has a chance to win, that tee shot on 15 really bugs him. It does, no question. He said it. He said yeah. that there's some shots that bother 14 and 15, and that this is Griffin, your leader, at the Whoa. 15th. Oh my, Smiley. I, I couldn't see it all. How yeah, about that, that, was, that was a, a beautiful stinger there, guys. That was fun to watch. It hit on the down slope, and it added 40, 50 yards. 14th fairway, and it's Aaron Badley. Working it from right to left, yeah. riding the wind. It looks like it's on a great line, and it is. So Badley will have a good shot at making birdie there. Look at Thomas Dietrich here at the this third shot at the 17th. The hole that was easily reachable for everybody in the field today. And these tee shots back into the wind, but you do have that slope if you want to use it. Dietrich, a very experienced player on the DP World Tour. Seamus Power for birdie to share of the lead. Yep, back into the wind, gonna move left. Has a great sense of humor about playing in this wind, was laughing about how much wind there was, and... Power birdies it for the third straight day. How about that? Most of the players been starting it at that bunker left of the green, and it ends up on the right side. That's where that started. Yep, exactly right, Kurt. This actually looks really good. Hey, he's played some impressive shots. He has got some game. Seamus Power on the upslope. How's the lie, Karen? It's actually sitting down quite a bit, but the upslope will help. Yeah, and the wind will help. Yeah, I think you just get this one just outside the right edge and get it rolling. Like that. Just like that. And we have a new leader quite uphill, but the wind quite heavily off the left. I mean, there's a hair of help in it. Oh, there we go. It helps when you drive it down there. You only have 86 yards left to a back hole location. Yeah, the pushing driver up here has given him only 100 yards. Oh, look at this. 
saddle in there. Good Hello. shot. Is to carry a share of the lead into the final round. What a round from the rookie Ben Griffin. Five under 66. Seamus Power and Ben Griffin, your co-leaders, who do you think is the favorite going into the final round? I, it's, I think it's hard to make a favorite there, but I'm going to give it to, to Seamus Power just because he's won once already on the PGA Tour, had a really solid season this past season as well. So I'm going to give it to Seamus Power, but you still got to go play. You got to play well because Ben Griffin showed a lot today. I thought he was impressive. Thanks for watching the PGA Tour on YouTube. To watch another video, click here.